Hi, hello, and everyone. Welcome to Traders Corner. Okay, today I would like to share uh, how did Nifty and Bank Nifty move today, and let's see how the entry triggered. So first of all, I'll start with the Bank Nifty. So this was the two boxes which I have mentioned yesterday, and these are the various levels I have marked. So what happened today was like yesterday the market ended with two solid green candles so which showed little bit sign of bullishness and momentum and today what happened the market opened like with uh, some kind of pressure but it did not hold the yesterday's closing and it went down actually this is a minor demand zone market it took an entry over here and it went to into a sideways market so someone who knows about supply and demand they might have taken entry over here so if they might have taken entry for 377 or 365 they could have achieved a target of uh, 362 560 approximately which is nothing but 200 points Okay, so this target has achieved like it took one hour almost to achieve the target and also if you see uh, only if someone might have taken an entry here they would have got it if not there is no opportunity and market was moving in a sideways over here so there is no buying or selling opportunity at this moment since the opening candle is a sideways if one wants any upward movement it should break high or it should break low. But as per the concept which I have followed, what has happened is this was yesterday's high. And if you see like this was a master candle. Either it's a master candle or else uh, it made a range bound market or an inside candle where the market was almost grinding till 10.30. So what happened at 10.30, it broke the range and as per the method I followed like for every breakout, I need a, another confirmation candle which came here in this candle. But even then to go for a long trade, our day high should be broken. So which happened at 11.15. 11.15, it broke day's high and also it gave a strong confirmation for the range breakout of yesterday's position created. So for the same, if this range bound is broken, the immediate target is nothing but on the top of it, like whatever the range it is. Okay. So this is what it is. So as per the logic I teach or I follow, anyone who is an aggressive trader, when this candle high is broken, they can go for a long setup. But what I suggest always is this was a breakout candle for this uh, range bound and this is a confirmation candle for me because I want the day high to be taken also. So as per this, after the buy is confirmed, it is a pure buy on dips. So as per the logic, this was the low and this was the high. I waited for the market to come to for a retracement which is nothing but approximately 0.5 levels it exactly came here and this is what my entry point for today so long position and my target was a little bit higher but I kept this as a day low because this is my demand zone at the moment. okay so this is my demand zone at the moment so i took my entry here and i would have average even if it is coming down okay so i wa i waited for 0 0.5 levels and my target was nothing but the range double and for me any trade to happen my target should be minimum one is to two and if not uh, this immediate swing high will be the target so as per this if we see I took my first entry only by 12.30 and I waited for the target of this is the level. 
so this was my level but this was my target 45684 so what happened like it took all the day and it like it gave close enough to here so when the market came to uh, this zone i closed my target actually because this is a huge selling area i did not wait for the full target and i closed my trade at this point and i left only uh, 25% of my entry keeping my entry point as stop loss and what has happened it came down for another retracement I was holding 25% of my quantity and hit my full target of this one at close to end of the day so this was my entry for bank nifty today so these are the levels um, <clears throat> So as per yesterday's uh, breakout failure, market has reached the point from where it got sold off and now this range it becomes invalid. And this zone it is tested once but still it can act as a minor support for tomorrow and the remaining levels it will stay Okay, so the what is the view which I have got at the moment is this was first inside bar and again now this is the second one. So we have two green candles closed above and it is sustaining. So the target to be given is nothing but. So even if this supply is uh, Rejected from here tomorrow, we can expect the market to go to this levels and get one kind of rejection from this point. Okay, so for the market to go further, as I have marked in my previous video explanation, I want to green candle to sustain above this for the market to go up further. If not, we can kind we can expect one. If not, we can expect market to reject from this level and it can fall. So I will wait for the breakout to happen with two green candle above this. Then only I'll be initiating my trade. If not, I'll be waiting and I'll wait and I'll look for a sell opportunity at this levels. Okay, so the levels what I have given yesterday, it is same. Okay, the levels which I have given yesterday, it is valid for this week actually. And these are the various levels. So kindly have a look of these levels and make your trades. So thank you for watching the video. And I'll be updating the trade setup on day-to-day -day basis. And if you guys have any doubt, do comment on the section below. Or else you can ask uh, any doubts in the Telegram group also. So have a nice trading day guys. Thank you.